I'm predicting that this is gonna be a fairly short video because when it comes to AirPods 3, I don't have a lot to complain about. And when I don't have a lot to complain about, I don't rant nearly as much and then the length of my videos gets just cut in half. In other more positive words, I really like these. They are a solid addition to Apple's lineup and despite one small problem that we'll get into later on, they are an excellent set of wireless earbuds. On the outside, the case for the AirPods 3 looks very similar to what you'd find with the AirPods Pro. It's slightly less wide and a little bit taller, but other than that, they look pretty much identical. Same position for the charging light, same pairing button on the back, and same lightning port on the bottom. Hidden within the AirPods 3 case is a feature that AirPods Pro didn't originally have though, MagSafe compatibility. Up until earlier this year, AirPods Pro had a wireless charging case, but it didn't magnetically snap to MagSafe accessories like the new AirPods 3 case does. I really don't want this to be a full video comparing the AirPods 3 to the AirPods Pro though. Maybe I'll make another one later on if you guys are interested in that, but I do wanna draw one more comparison here. The AirPods 3 just looked like Apple took the AirPods Pro, chopped off the silicone ear tips, and then called it a day. They look very, very similar to the point where I don't think you could tell the difference between someone wearing AirPods 3 versus someone wearing AirPods Pro. Much more importantly though, the AirPods 3 are extremely comfortable. Like they nailed the in-ear comfort of these things. I'll be the first to admit that the previous iterations of regular AirPods didn't fit very well and I didn't really like them for that reason, but these are much better. I've spent several hours walking around with them in and they've never fallen out either. They don't feel quite as secure as earbuds that actually have those silicone tips that the AirPods Pro have, but they're definitely comfortable. Battery life is better this year too. Apple's claiming that the buds are gonna give you between five and six-ish hours of listening time, and then the case will give you another 18 or 19 hours of use since it has internal batteries. I'd say that's fairly accurate. It's only been about a week since I've got them, so I'll have a little bit of a better picture once I use them more, but battery life has been great so far. To control these earbuds, I have to again bring up the AirPods Pro. They have the exact same pinch-enabled control panel at the bottom of each earbud. It's decent, but just like AirPods Pro, there's no way to control your volume from your earbuds unless you ask Siri, which is weird. Thankfully, we do get in-ear detection on these earbuds this year. If you pull an earbud out, your music will stop playing until you put it back in. Very helpful if you're listening to loud music and you want to hear someone talking to you a little bit better. Speaking of which, let's talk about microphone quality. Now, the mics in these earbuds are surprisingly good. And even though there's, you know, a little bit of that digital compression noise going on, it's still a much better sound than most of <laughs> Still much better sound than most other earbuds. And that brings us to the sound quality of these earbuds. Now, here's the thing about regular AirPods. I've never really been fond of how they sound, and that mostly comes down to how they're designed. They let sound in and out very easily, and I found that the low end of most songs just didn't really carry much weight. Now, AirPods 3 don't really fix that first part. They're still a very open design with very little cancellation, so sounds from your environment will very easily pass through and get in the way of your music. Now, depending on what you want to use them for, that could be a pro and it could definitely be a con. They also leak audio very well too. If you're the kind of person that likes to play very loud music, anyone standing in your immediate vicinity will be able to hear it at least a little bit as well. But that second part, the part about it lacking a low end, that part has been improved with these AirPods 3 quite a lot. I actually found myself really enjoying the audio quality of AirPods 3. They're way better than I remember AirPods 2 being, and even though I'm certainly no audiophile, I think most people will be very, very happy with how they sound. They've added a few new features to AirPods 3 that were there in AirPods Pro as well, like uh, spatial audio, Dolby Atmos, and adaptive EQ. Now keep in mind that many of those features that are on the AirPods 3 won't be available on an Android phone though. You'll get some limited spatial audio and Dolby Atmos support on Android, but worse than that is you'll be missing out on a lot of great features like uh, seamless switching between devices, uh, voice assistant support, notification announcements, and find my tracking. In fact, AirPods 3 are kind of a hard sell for Android users. I can see Android users going for the AirPods Pro because they have an excellent active noise cancellation and pass-through mode that can be used no matter what OS you're using but since most of the extra features of AirPods 3 are locked behind Apple's great walled garden, 
Android users get a little bit shafted. But that's not really the small problem I talked about at the beginning of this video. It's related, but it's not what I was referring to. The problem is that these new AirPods 3 are priced very closely to what the AirPods Pro often go for. I've often seen the AirPods Pro sell for as low as like 190 US dollars. And while that isn't cheap, it's only like $10 more than the 180 that these are selling for now. Now I'm sure AirPods 3 will go on sale too once they've been out for a little while longer, but for right now, I'd actually recommend waiting to find a good deal on AirPods Pro, unless you specifically want the AirPods 3 for the fact that you don't have to stick those silicone tips in your ear. The AirPods 3 are a fantastic set of earbuds. I just wish they'd price them a little bit more competitively. Either way, hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching, and as always, have a great day.